What's good y'all, it's your boy Ross back here again with another video. So, I'm at my grandmother's house. This is why the setup is different right now. Um, and I had to make this impromptu video because you guys were hitting me up on Twitter, on Instagram, letting me know that Cody Rose and Brandy Rose, they decided to leave AEW. This was released on AEW's official Twitter. In this little statement right here. Cody and Brandy Rose were integral to the launch of All Elite Wrestling. Cody's ability combined with his boldness and his passion for our industry and his love for the community outreach helped AEW deliver on our mission to give fans what they needed for far too long. Something new, innovative, and lasting. Brandy helped us shape the AEW story and I appreciate how hard she fought for us both in the ring and out the ring, competing in the women's division while advancing our efforts at inclusion and civic causes, including great partnership with Culture City and the American Heart Association. I have immense respect and appreciation for Cody and Brandy and I wish them the best, wish them both the best as they move from AEW. Thank you, Cody and Brandy. This is by Tony Khan himself. I thought that was, you know, a nice little heartfelt message or whatnot. And then I believe uh, Cody had said something to himself. I have loved my time at AEW. Amazing locker room, amazing fans, amazing people. The revolution was indeed televised. And I've been incredibly lucky to be a part of that. First, I want to thank Tony Khan. He's taken the baton and run with it. And it was an honor to work for him and to know him on a personal level. He's a beautiful soul. Obviously need to thank my incredible wife and the mother of my baby girl, Brandy, for all of her love and support throughout this journey together and the amazing relationships she fostered with Culture City and the American Heart Association. Also need to thank Nick and Matt Jackson. These two, whether they know it or not, took and undesired and not confident little cub and gifted me the confidence to become a leader of the pack. Kenneth Omega, Chris Jericho, Chicken, we started the fire. I must thank Tim White, Keith M, uh, Greg White, I'm not sure their last names, and the amazing production crew who understood and captured the vision with such grace. I can't name everybody, but I thank you uh, to May, uh, Miga, uh, Margaret, Harrington, Jeff Jones, Dana, Tony, Shivani, Byrne, Raph, and the hardest worker in the game, QT Marshall, for propping me up and kicking me in the ass when I was running on fumes. I must thank all my kiddos, MJF, uh, Jay, Sammy, Darby, Lee, uh, Ricky, Tom, the Tom, uh, Tom, the, the Guns, Brock, Velvet, Nyla, Aubrey, Turner, Vanilla, Solo, Spears, Julia, Anna, Will, Warlow, Sonny, Fuego, One, and, and of course, Negative One. While we're at it, uh, give Jade and uh, Cody Vader. Also need to take a moment to thank the great partners of Warner at Warner Media, including Brett Sam and the rest of the team. I have so many milestones and beautiful memories of this renaissance through sweat, blood, and tears, literal fire, this is true, and all of that. I left it all on the mat. Everything pales in comparison to the final contribution. I was empowered to lead that company, the community outreach team. Uh, in the most inward moments, your outward behavior and your ability to take fame slash influence and, do, and to do something of value for the communities you visit. Whether the cameras are on or off is the highest honor. I am confident Amanda Huber will lead the department with style. I am so proud of my creations and contributions and the items uh, I supported or collaborated or with such wonderful professionals. Thank you, fans. Y'all did the work. Let's live forever. Hey, man. Heartfelt message. Uh, I think that was that was pretty cool, man. I, I can't even can't even uh, get mad at uh, what he said. He pretty much thanked everybody and he, he did. He did what he wanted to do. He he left WWE and he wanted to be able to cultivate something that the fans could be really proud of and really appreciate in watching a wrestling product that is about the wrestling more than anything else. And I, I appreciate it, man. That's that is something that, you know, no one thought could be done, but they're doing it. And AEW is still thriving. I know a lot of 
of fans, uh, you know, were wanting him to turn heel and stuff like that. But he stayed true to what he wanted his character to be. So I can only respect that. Um, I know there's some reports now that he's saying, you know, saying they, they may go to WWE. I don't think they should. I think they should do whatever they want to do. Going to WWE, I just don't see how that benefits him. You know what I'm saying? Especially what he's created and cultivated in AEW. I just don't how it's I just don't see how it benefits him going to the WWE. I just don't think that would I think that's a step backwards, in my opinion. But you never know. You never know when it comes to wrestling. Um and then I believe Dustin, uh his brother had tweeted that he's still staying in AEW. So we'll see how that plays out. But hey, I will say this, man, even though the fans wanted him to turn heel, you cannot deny what he was able to do with the help of Tony Khan and the help of others and really pushing this movement and getting AEW to where it is now. All you can do is give give the man respect, him and his wife respect, because that, that was a big task for them to, you know, really try to push forward, and they were able to. And AEW is doing better for it. So, hey, man. This was cool to see, and I'm, I'm looking forward to see what he does in the future. I know he's been getting into it with television. Like, he's been doing a little reality stuff on television. So, Cody will be around. It just depends on where he will be at, man. So, this was this was heartfelt, and I, I definitely wanted to make sure I took time to record this. Even though the setup's not good, the audio's probably crazy, uh, I just wanted to make sure to let you guys know i did see this and i wanted to record this so comment down below let me know what's your thoughts on uh uh him and his wife leaving AEW. are you guys disappointed about it are you guys i hope some of you i mean maybe there are some of you guys that are okay that he's leaving AEW. are you guys happy about it do you guys think he should go to wwe do you guys think he should go to another promotion like what what do you think uh his future may be uh in the upcoming months and years like where where he'll be at so i want to get your thoughts and opinions down below i know this is a quick impromptu video on my phone but i just wanted to get you guys something uh, more videos will be dropping later on today but i appreciate all the love and support road to 70k appreciate y'all kicking with me see y'all in the next one peace